The gut, also known as the gastrointestinal GI, tract or digestive tract, is a complex system responsible for the breakdown and absorption of food as well as the elimination of waste. It starts at the mouth and ends at the anus, and it consists of various organs including the esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, colon, rectum, and anus. The gut is often referred to as the second brain, due to its complex network of nerves known as the enteric nervous system, ENS. The ENS consists of millions of neurons that line the walls of the digestive tract, allowing the gut to function independently of the brain and spinal cord. Here are some key points about the gut and why it is called the second brain. 1. Nervous system connection. The gut contains a significant number of neurons, more than the spinal cord or peripheral nervous system. This network of neurons enables the gut to think and influence various bodily functions without input from the central nervous system. 2. Neurotransmitters and hormones. The gut produces and uses several important neurotransmitters and hormones, including serotonin, dopamine, and gamma-aminobutyric acid, GABA. These compounds play a crucial role in regulating mood, appetite, digestion, and even immune function. 3. Gut-brain axis. The gut and brain are in constant communication through a bidirectional pathway known as the gut-brain axis. This connection allows the gut to send signals to the brain and vice versa, influencing mood, emotions, and even cognitive functions. 4. Gut microbiota. The gut is also home to trillions of microorganisms collectively known as the gut microbiota. These bacteria, viruses, and fungi play a crucial role in digestion, nutrient absorption, and overall gut health. Additionally, research suggests that the microbiota may influence brain function and mental health. 5. Emotion and gut health. The gut has a close relationship with our emotions. For example, when we experience stress or anxiety, it can cause gastrointestinal symptoms such as stomach aches or butterflies in the stomach. This connection highlights the relationship between our emotional state and gut health. 6. Gut health and disease. Imbalances in the gut microbiota and disruptions in the gut-brain axis have been linked to various digestive disorders, such as irritable bowel syndrome, IBS, inflammatory bowel disease, IBD, and even mental health conditions like depression and anxiety. In summary, the gut is often referred to as the second brain due to its complex network of neurons and its ability to independently regulate various bodily functions. Its close connection to the brain, the gut-brain axis, and the influence of the gut microbiota all contribute to its reputation as the second brain.